Subscapers and welcome to Garden of Tranquility quest guide. The quest requirements are Creature of Fengen Shrine and the skill requirements are 25 farming. The item requirements are Ring of Karos, which is untradeable and is obtained from Creature of Fengen Shrine quest. I will show you how to get it next. One watering can with some water in it, six cabbage seeds, six onion seeds, two marigold seeds, seven super composts, one rune or pure essence, two plant cures, fly fishing rod or a regular one, a filled plant pot, and the recommended items are one rosemary seed. The recommended unlocks are lowstones to Ardoin, Perthorpe, Canifis, Cutterby, Trainer Village, Edgeville, Lumbridge and Varrock. There are no enemies to defeat. Let's go! In case you have completed the Great Brain Robbery quest, you can get the Ring of Karos from the spot marked right there, and it's in the basement. You have to pickpocket Dr. Fengerswein, and there you go. Otherwise, I will show you how to get it. First things first, we are getting the Ring of Karos by using the Lodestone to Canifis and running to the Creature of Fengerswein castle. Go upstairs. Go to the middle of the room and climb up the ladder. Then pickpocket Dr. Fengerstein and you should have your ring of carols. Now to start off the quest, use the lodestone to Varrock. Go north, and we are heading to the Varrock Castle's garden. Talk to Queen Ella Maria. Accept the quest. Talk to her again. Select the chat options. How am I supposed to move status all the way here? Put on your Ring of Karos, and we are using the Lodestone to train our village. We are heading to Wise Old Man next. He is located north of the bank. Talk to the Wise Old Man with Ring of Karos equipped, and select the chat options No. Queen Ella Maria has sent me to seek your guidance. Show them a range of colors so that they can come to compromise. Take his generous gift, even though you have no need for it. It's absolutely, unquestionably the most interesting thing I've ever done. Put on the silly helmet and jump into the cannon. You, of course, PK Master, ask me nicely and I might consider it. No, especially not that wise old man who doesn't look at all suspicious. Use the lodestone to get by. We are heading to the farming allotments.
talk to Dantaira and select the chat options. Do you know how I could grow a white tree? I think that there is something that you are not telling me. A secret is a dreadful burden to have to keep to yourself. Unless you allow me to do this, she will die anyway. Here's the lodestone to Edgeville. We are heading to the ice mountain. Click on the white tree. Select the secretors. Use the white tree shoot to the plant pot and water it. Use the lodestone to Edgeville. We are heading to the Edgeville monastery. Try to take a seed from the rose bushes. When you get the chat options, select the These are the most beautiful rose bushes I've ever seen. Unequip your ring of carrots, and we are heading to Edgeville's well. It's east of the lodestone. Right click the ring of carrots and use it to the well. Head back to Edgeville Monastery's bushes. Check the rose bushes again. Talk to Brother Altric. Pick from all of the different color rose bushes and you will get four seeds of each one of them. Let's head back to Edgeville's well. Right click your fishing rod and use it to the well. This might take quite some time, so good luck. Equip the Ring of Karos A. Let's head to the Canifis allotment spot. You can get there by using the Canifis lodestone or the Ectovile. Make sure you have your Ring of Karos equipped and talk to Lyra. Select the chat options. Do you have any Orchid seeds to spare? If you tell me your problems, I may be able to help you. Yes, I was wondering about that. Times must be very hard for you. Whatever you've done, I'm sure you had just cause. And what is the nature of this fee that you pay? If not yours, then whose blood are you offering? How can you deal with so much guilt? That's a deal. I'll grow a patch of onions for you. Plant your onion seeds and optionally plant one marigold. That will protect the onions and the growing process will take around 40 minutes. Let's head to Ardoin by using the lodestone and we are heading to the allotments.
Make sure you have your Ring of Kvaros equipped and talk to Kraken. Select the chat options. Do you have any snowdrop seeds to spare? You seem to be a little irritable, my friend. I don't like to see a fellow human being so upset. So what ails you, my friend? Well, is there anything I can do for you? So, what can I do for you? That's a deal. I'll let you know when your cabbages are ready. Plant your cabbage seeds and optionally plant a rosemary. That will protect the cabbages. This will take another 40 minutes. Let's head to Port Sarim. We are heading to the Falador's allotments, which are north of the Port Sarim Slowstone. Make sure you have your Ring of Karos equipped and talk to Elstan. Select the chat options. Do you have any Delphinum seeds to spare? That is why I have come to an expert for advice. Not just an expert, Elstan. They say you are the expert. Oh no, I love listening to gardening stories. Millions? Ah, just what I wanted to hear. Okay, I'll grow you some miracles. Plant one marigold seed, and this will take 20 minutes. Use the lodestone to Taverly. Head southeast. There is Bernard, so talk to him. And select the chat options. But it is the only way that these wines will be cured. I accept the deal. From your inventory, use the plant cure to his grapevines. Talk to Bernard again. Run north. By the three patch, there is a line. Talk to him and select the chat options. I need to ask you about strong plant cures. Are you sure there's nothing you can suggest? Head north to the smithing anvils. From your inventory, use the pure or rune essence to an anvil. Head back to Bernard. Click on the rune shards to grind them and use the rune dust to the plant cure. Let's head to Bernard. Use the new plant cure to the grapevines. Talk to Bernard. Use the lodestone to Lumbridge. We are getting the statues to the Warrock Garden. Use the trolley to the southern statue, and now we need to push it across the nearby bridge.
this will start a cutscene and you will arrive nearby Varrock's garden. Keep pushing this statue and I will show you where to put it next. Make sure it goes through this gap. And now push it to the eastern side of the wall. There is a plinth. Right click it and select the place option. Use the loadstone to Falador, we are getting the second statue. There it is. Use the trolley on it and it will start a cutscene. Push this statue all the way to the north through the gates. You will arrive at the Varrock Gardens, keep pushing the statue and make sure it gets to Varrock Garden. Push it a little bit more to the south. There is our next stage of plint. Right click the statue and use the place option. Now we are planting the Warrock Garden. Start by raking the patches. Use the green rose seeds to the western patch. 
break some more patches. Use the pink rose seeds to the delphinum patch. And use the white tree sapling to the center patch. Break the southern patch and use the red rose seeds to it. Then the southeastern patch and use the white rose seeds to it. And lastly the southwestern one. Break it and plant the pink rose seeds. Use your super composts to the plant pots. Use the lodestone to port serum. We are heading to Falador's allotment spot. This is the first waiting part, so I will let you know when things start to happen again. I will be pretty much disassembling some maple logs and I will put a timer on the video. All right, see you in a bit. We are back. 
harvest the marigolds and talk to Elston. Select the chat options, I have those marigolds for you. We are using the lodestone to canifish and heading to the canifish allotment spot. Time for another waiting part. I will tell you when we are ready.
And we are back. Harvest the onions. Talk to Lyra. Select the chat options. Can I have some more orchid seeds? Make sure you get the orchid seeds into your inventory and we are using the lodestone to Ardoin. Let's head to the allotment spot. Harvest the cabbages. Talk to Kragen. Select the chat options. OK, I've grown those cabbages like you asked. And you should get some seeds. Now we are returning to Varok's garden. Break the eastern patch and plant the snowdrop seeds into it. Break the delphinum patch and plant the delphinum seeds into it. Finally, put the remaining seeds into the plant pots and wait for everything to grow. See you in a bit.
We are back. Talk to Ella Maria. Go to the king and talk to him. Select the chat options, ask King Rold to follow you. Of course, your majesty, please forgive me. The queen asked me to bring you. Congratulations, Garden of Tranquility quest completed. This quest is required for completing Defender of Arok, full completion of Missing My Mommy and Swan Song. Remember to leave a like, comment and subscribe and see you in the next one.